Oh, so today I'll be saying the top five free Mac App Store apps. These are not games, but they're applications that I use for a computer. So coming at number five would be Smart Converter. Uh, this is a converter that allows you to take any file. For example, let's take this one. You drop it in here. And uh, let's say I want it for iPhone slash iPod. I'd press Convert. Close this and it will slowly convert the video for the iPod touch it also works with an Android app uh, Android phone, Android tablet, music, other so PlayStation, Audio, Microsoft, Apple TV, etc. So it's a very nice application the free version works fine while the pro version costs money and it allows you to have multiple conversions at the same time so coming at number four would be Blackmagic disk speed test this is a benchmarking application that demonstrates how fast the write and read performance is on your solid state and it also tells you what specific formats will function on your Mac. So as you see here my write speed is 409 megabytes per second while my read on my solid state is 453.7 megabytes per second. All right. Uh, next up number three would be CPU LED this, these are the CPU LEDs you see right here. It pretty much indicates if all my eight cores are in usage. You can also see the refresh intervals. You can change the colors if you want different types of colors. For example, these you can have thin. You can have them as pills. You can have them as colored bars or a 3D chip, which is pretty cool. Now you can have show activity average for all processors or for each processor and also CPU temperature scale etc. Now you can also buy these add-ons and you have an about section over here. All right. And you can also do start CPU LED at logging. Let's turn that on. All right. Uh, coming at number two would be coconut battery. This is basically a battery more so for the uh, MacBooks it pretty much tells you a history of all of your battery so as you can see here this is when I first got my Mac I had 100 percent battery usage with eight cycles and eventually you can see as it deteriorates you can see the battery is charging the temperature is 30.9 degrees Celsius how many char times I charged my Mac so right here it states I charged it 192 times my Mac is one year old and then my Mac model along with my battery health and the current charge. So even though it says 94% here, it says 98% there. So it's pretty contradictory. And number one is Text Wrangler. So this is a scripting application. You could use it to write applications uh, for programming. So hello world. And it's pretty much similar to Notepad++. You can save a copy to FTP. You can change the language, multi lines, etc. This is similar to um, to Moon Develop, as I said, Notepad plus plus on Windows, uh, Visual Studio, etc. So uh, thank you for watching this video, and stay tuned for more episodes on paid applications as well. So bye.